we're doing now? That's good, man. Hello. Hello. Sounded good? Yes. Hello. Okay, we, do we need to wait on somebody? I guess yeah, so. Yeah, just a few seconds. Here. Sure, let's open that blind up so they can see us standing in here. Like <laughs> someone mooning. So we can all <laughs> <laughs> It's got to be the drummer. Is the drummer here? <laughs> no way. It's got to be the bass player, right? No way. Well, who the hell are we waiting on then? The no, sample. The sample. Oh, well, he doesn't have a real job. <laughs> <laughs> God damn, I oh, I thought that one. was him. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, like, what the hell are those people doing in the chaos studio? <laughs> That's not him. Like, can we fake it? Can we bring that guy in? We're picking and grinning. Yeah. What can we do? He's going to be like, he can be <laughs> West. <laughs> he won't be on. <laughs> what we ought to do is have him come in tomorrow. And uh, we'll record a few things and then sample them into. Overdub them. Now we can wait a little bit. Yeah, I, got, I just uh, got off the phone with Nuge, man, so we're going to do a, a break next Friday night. That's another reason why I wanted to get you guys in for Local Licks. We're going to run up Nuge. He'll be in Ardmore Thursday, April 19th with Derek St. Holmes. It's going to be like a family reunion, man. It's going to be insane. Man. Sounds awesome. Oh, so, uh, it's going to be good. Awesome. I, uh, I, was, I was flipping through the channels. I don't really listen to Keith Vaughn that much, but he did an interview with him earlier Yeah, Vaughn's the man, dude. And I, uh, so I, I had to listen to that one. I stopped well, listening yeah. to it for a while. Yeah. Lon's all right, but Nuge is a man. Yeah, there's only one Nuge. My twin brother from a different mother. Uh, yes. <laughs> when I grow up, I'm going to be Ted Nugent. He's, he's great at it. Yeah, I've heard, I heard a couple of his interviews, and he's just great at it. Oh, him. man, you don't have to do shit. You just, hey, it's Ted Nugent. Yeah, I've seen him on Wednesday. So, Purple, and he just, he'll, yeah, five oh, minutes about. Yeah. Oh, one of my favorite moments. I've got... I've been fortunate over the years. We have the annual Kumbaya Sacred America Barbecue Campfire Sing Along with the Nuge at least once a year. He'll give us a call and we'll just lose <coughs> hell for an hour. It's a beautiful thing, but one of my personal favorite critter moments. And you're not going to be able to hear it. That was my son's first concert, man, was Ted Nuge. He got to go back and see Nuge. That night we're sitting there, you know, we're doing our thing, having a great time. And, and uh, you know, the boys right there at the time, I think he was like seven. And Nuge is up there, and he goes in and he starts playing. He says, for all my Spirit of the Wild Blood Brothers and NRA members out there, I want to say I love you, Booby Critter, the DJ man. This one's for you. Went right into Strangleholds. Oh, I was fucking oh. unlivable from that moment on. <laughs> I became a cool dad that night. <laughs>